Wasn't really trying to let me record him, but it's all what I'm gonna be doing. I've already somewhat. <laughs> Can you guys see that? I guess I just missed the spot. What up? What up? I'm jumping right into this. So right now I'm on my way to pick up a set of. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna tell you guys yet. I'm on my way to pick something up for the hatch. Uh, don't know if it's for the hatch or for the Type 4. I think it's for the hatch. I've just been looking for these for a while. And I'm super excited. I'm For like the price that they are at, I'm super excited. And the condition, you know. So, show you guys in a bit how they look, I guess, when I pull up back to the house. I don't have them yet. I'm still about 20 minutes away kind of deep it was like an hour and 30 from my house but as soon as a friend of mine sent them to me had to jump on them so yeah I've always thought about doing this like when I either like go pick up parts or something like when I meet up with somebody for something like I've always thought like I should have recorded that I'm gonna ask the guy <laughs> I don't know if it's weird I'm gonna be like is it cool if I like record this I don't know we'll see we'll see because uh, I think somebody like if I said that to him they're like, oh, you have a YouTube channel? Like, yeah, you know, how many subscribers do you have? 200 subscribers. <laughs> He's probably gonna be like, uh, nah, I'm good then, man. They wanna, they wanna be on the channels that have a lot of subscribers, but it's all good, I'll ask them anyway. But yeah, guys, hope you guys are excited. And yeah. All right, guys, so these are the seats. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna make it the title of the video now, but I'll pick these up. The guy wasn't really trying to let me record them, but it's all good. So these are black cars. Everybody knows them. Has a little damage right there, but I'll go over them more when I get to the house. All right, guys and girls. So I'm back home. I wasn't trying to start, talk too loud in that last clip because uh, there was like a girl right behind me and stuff. And it was just awkward, but so picked up these seats, Integra Type R. JDM Recaros, SR3s, everybody knows these seats. If you're if you're watching this, you know these seats. But either way, so they came with no rails, but have a friend that said he has a set that should work, so I'm gonna test those out. But I'm super excited to finally have a pair of these because I've been looking for a while for a good for a good price. I mean just cause, I don't know, I'm not really trying to spend that much on them, but, so just to throw it out there, I got them for $700, which is not bad right now for the, you know, what they go for. And then this one right here has a little bit of damage, but I think I can get that sewed up. Uh, I've seen worse and I've seen them, I mean, I've seen them come back and technically, like if I leave this one on my driver's side, when I get in and out, you won't really see it, if you get what I mean, so clean that up there's a little tear right there maybe i could sew that as well but this uh passenger seat you can kind of even tell on camera this one's like a little more blue this one's like a straight black this one's in much better condition overall but no matter what i'm super excited let me turn these so you guys can see better all right yeah so right there you can see the difference this one's a little more blue than that one but it's all good i'll be sitting in there and you won't even notice and so i'm still gonna do what i always do i'm gonna vacuum them off and then i'm gonna steam them but uh more than likely these will be going in the hatch i know they would look really nice in the integra type r but my my stock seats in the type r are pretty clean you know and I love keeping it all original. So we'll see, maybe one day I'll just toss them in just to toss them in, but yeah. So more than likely this is going in the hatch. And yeah, super excited. Also, forgot to mention, finally got these back. So from here, they look good, but up close, you can still see the circuit and I don't know. They're not bad. The H is a little too big, honestly. And that's what I was scared of, but 
they're fine for now. I think eventually though, I am gonna have somebody make me some smaller ones, some smaller emblems, and then I'm gonna redo the whole thing, the whole process, but this is how they came out. So I'll show you guys how they look on the car. All right, what's up guys? So, I don't know, I can't remember where I left off, but here's where I'm at. Both seats are clean. My girlfriend stitched up this one seat. I'll show that in a bit, the one that had the slight bit of damage. But so I didn't have rails like I told you guys, I believe I said that. And a um, friend of mine, always a friend, shout out to, man, you know who you are. He doesn't really like me saying his name, <laughs> but you know who you are. Um, he dropped these off for me. He said they came out of an EK. The only thing is they're like super low and they don't have the mounting tabs. So what I'm at right now is I am drilling out the tabs and holes so that it could bolt up to all four corners and i've already been doing it but yeah i just i just forgot to pick up the camera and document it and the way i explain this to like some people when they ask like is it hard to like record and stuff like that is the recording part is just annoying because like i don't know how old everybody is that's watching this but in school like in when i was in high school like in math class they make you show your work you can't just you can't just do all the work in your head and then put the answer down. You have to show the work. So me, I'm just exactly the same way. I like to just do it. You know, I like to just start doing it and then I get lazy to pick up the camera. I don't like to show the work. I just like to show it done. You know what I mean? But it's a bad habit either way. This is where I'm at. I already drilled out this one, got it bolted onto one side. So now I'm drilling out the corner. I'm going to do those and then I'm going to put it in, see how I like the fitment and everything. I kind of, so what I did was I laid the bracket in there and bolted up. Then I put this tape to line up to where I needed to, and I marked it on the rail, and then I started drilling like that. So that's how I'm doing it, and it's going well so far, so I'll update you guys in a little bit. Can you guys see that? So she's in, looks real nice, but the only thing is, is um, my bad, is I know it's dark. It's really late, my bad. I know you guys can't see, but yeah, she's in, so it fit up perfect. It's just kind of low, but I mean, I don't mind that at all. I was really stressing about how what I was gonna do with some rails, but if it's perfect in there. Only thing is I won't ever be able to move back and forth, but it's, it's my size, so that's all that matters. So now I'm just gonna drill the other side and I'm gonna put it in and it should be on, on there secure. I'll try to get some better shots in the morning or something this isn't going to be the end of the video but i just want to show you guys that they're in got her all washed up center caps are on i don't know if i've shown this already oh my what is this oh i guess i just missed the spot but i don't know if i've shown this yet i just put these on the other night But show you guys the main part. Came out super nice. Rails, I think I'm gonna one of these days take off, sand them down, paint them black so you don't really see that anymore, but Come on, really nice. So there it is. Let me know what you guys think. I'm super excited. Finally have a set. Yeah. This car is looking really good. Super excited how it's turning out. I think the center caps came out really good. Just the H, a little too big. Some of them have some imperfections and stuff, but from back here, they look perfect. So that's all that matters. Let me know what you guys think about how the car is coming out. I kind of, we'll see. I thought of maybe going with a carbon lip. And since I have those carbon mirrors that are still gonna get redone, I'm thinking it might go well together. Let me know if you guys think that's a good idea or not, or just do the OEM lip, 
do the EK9 style mirrors and then an EK9 wing. The wing, of course, I'm gonna get no matter what, but yeah, the car's coming out beautiful. I'm super excited. I feel like my interior is done. But yeah, so like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. When I wake up, my tent drops. I'm frozen, my wrist shows. When I wake up, my tent drops. I'm frozen, my wrist shows. Fall and break the laws, drop a nigga for some rock. Fuck him in the cross, take another hit of pop. Yeah. Lost V8 stop, Devin doesn't talk. Yeah. Riding through the city with my baby.